Okay, welcome back. Uh, oh, well, it is what it is. Today, we are back working on a Harley Davidson. Of course, today's video is going to be a little simple video, so nothing fancy. It's just a continuation of what I started. All right, so what are we going to do? Flipping around the camera. My bike got smoked all over. These are custom dynamics. These are Harley Davidsons. Of course, I did not buy these because they came with the bike when I bought the bike. So, however, I bought those two. Now, the only thing left is this one. The only thing red left on my bike. Also, as you can see, the, these are two pack lights, side lights. These are custom dynamics too. So, I bought these. These were bought by the previous owner. And I bought that. So, my goal is to replace everything red on this bike and make it look uh, smoked and uh, black if you go back to the front of the bike as you can see i got nothing red except these i might have to find the clear reflectors and replace those two but i don't think it's gonna be easy to find them anyhow today's video I um, got this, I didn't get it from Custom Dynamics, but I got this from Harley, so this is what you're going to put on and replace this, this to match the rest of the bike. Alright, let's get on it. However, now while we are here, before we get on it, I'll show you what I'm going to do if I get another bike. There are uh, a couple of screws here. There, are, there is uh, one screw right there, and there is another one over there. This one, those holds the light. This one here, it holds the bracket. That bracket, that's for the cable. I got two options. I can expand that and slide the bracket out, and slide this cable out that means i have to beat it back in or i can take the screw out and slide i don't know either way it looks like i'm gonna have to expand it to get this cable out so for me to do that i'm gonna need first of all let's loosen this which is gonna I found that 11 millimeters was perfect, so which means this is a, a standard American, like a, I think 3.8, I don't know. So, 11 millimeters works fine. And then, for this one, I used uh, this two. I gotta use, I think, a T30, so. So we're gonna take that out or loosen it up, but preferably I'll take it out. Also, I gotta work faster because my camera is not waiting for me. So Come on, boy. Oh, yeah. You have to be on your back, especially when you don't have... I don't even know if my camera is capturing anything. Whew. Okay, let me see. This one is handle loose. Okay, that one fell off. So, I'm gonna take that off, probably hang it on a, hang it by a, so this one. I can probably use the wrench by hand. Ah, 
Oh. Okay. Let's go back to that one. So. I don't know why I'm making this like a tutorial and I know that there are so many people out there who replace this light. Okay, there you go. So now that is loose. I believe this light. See, now it's being held by this cable. So, I don't think I want to take that bolt out, even though it's re even though it's recommended. The reason is, either way, even if I take it out, I'm gonna have to expand this to push it out, because you see it's tight. And, <sighs> this little head, it's bigger than the, it's bigger than this uh, uh, cable management tube. So either way, I'm gonna have to expand it. So if you've taken it out, I'm gonna expand it while it's in there. So what I gotta do is grab two screws, a screwdriver, and loosen those two out there. Let's just do that. Okay, I got my long screw. So what I gotta do is loosen that up and loosen this up. The screwdriver doesn't have to be this long. It's like a mile away. Okay, now bring that. Oh was nice and tight in there. I'm not gonna take it off. All I will do is just oh, figure where it plugs in. Okay, now. So we are back. So now I got it. So this is why it plugs in up here. If you look at it, this is the light. So I grab the cable for the light, shake it, see why it's moving. So it's right here. So what I gotta do is, oh, unplug it. Uh oh, this is weird because it's got another cable coming out here. So I don't know how this one works. I hope, I hope. I won't have to put it back because that's, that's going to suck. That is going to suck because I can see. Let's see. All right. Could you uh, get a break for me, please? What? Break. Let it go. Again. Let it go. Again. Let it go. Oh, okay. Thank you. It's so cold. It is cold. Alrighty. So I just tested it. I had to call my daughter to come and help me for a test. It's uh, a break slash running light so I don't need this uh, little cable that was plugged on there I don't know this cable right here I don't need it so this whole thing gonna pull out so let's do this okay if I do a comparison the cable I'm talking about you see they're all Harley Davidson but this one Got the third one coming out. See, well, this one got a third one in there. I assume this was the ground. I don't know. I'm not gonna. I don't know what's going on here. As you can see, this one got three coming in, and this one got two going in. However, this one was only running light. It wasn't no brakes. It just ran. This one got both. It got a brake. And the running light so I think that the difference already is she's done okay I'm coming she's done so looks good now nothing red 
put some power to it. So running right. So, <laughs> my daughter showed up, so my project is uh, going to be on halt because of my daughter showed up. The reason this, these are flashing, those are LEDs from Amazon, you know, the ones you hold the brake, they flash. So, they're, they're not syncing with that. Whatever I got going on, so. Let's check the functionality of that brake light. Mm. So, you hold the brake. Mm. Oh, my shoe is... Yeah. Okay, that's it pretty much, but there's no turn signal, so... Mm. Alrighty. This project is done. my bike much there's nothing red on it love it love the look it's subtle all right thank you for watching so my daughter just showed up she wants to go for a bike ride you okay sweetheart mm -hmm. you want to go ride your bike and you want to go for a walk so okay I guess I have no say in it, so I got to go. All right, friends on uh, on the interweb. Thanks for watching my video. So please like, hit that thumbs up. That's what most YouTubers do anyway. Hit that thumbs up, and uh, see you in the next one. Thank you.